So just tune in to your body. Come into your own being. We're going to focus on the third eye, the mystic ray temple. When the lunar Ida Nadi and the solar Pingala Nadi dragons dance up your spine in the DNA spiral and meet in the Ajna Chakra, the mystic ray temple. Take a breath. Your third eye opens, just connecting to your breath, connecting to your receptivity. As these masculine and feminine energies merge with your Shashumna Chakra, the illusion of duality disappears, revealing the unity of all things. This is the resurrection that leads to self-realization. So just take your fingernail and on the middle of the top of your head, push in. And then take your fingernail away and just notice that space. So in this space where the crown chakra opens, opens, opens. Imagine the light of the higher self hitting this spot. An elixir of liquid light goes into your head. and pours over that pineal gland, that small gland, the size of a pea, bathing it, activating it. This is your antenna for the mystical. And as this golden liquid light dances around the pineal and makes its way down to the top of your spine, and dances down the Shashimna spinal column. This liquid light goes down, down, down your spine. 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 All the way to the root chakra. And allow this liquid light to pool at your root chakra. Just bring all your awareness to that root. And then you're going to breathe into this space. And breathe out, pulling it back in. So extending your belly and pulling back. You're filling your entire pelvic floor with light, every nook and cranny to breathe in, breathing out. Activating that energy. Let it begin to troll and spin. Activating the cerebral spinal fluid. Maybe your body oscillates. Maybe there's a team of wild horses dancing in that space or a cosmic ocean swirling and twirling. Activating the most powerful energy of creation. This energy creates life. So letting this energy dance up
and begins to make its way up. Up your spine. Up, up, up your spine. Bia, your Ida, your Bengala, like DNA chakra, it begins to go up, climbing your 33 vertebrae. So we're going to start at the bottom vertebrae. Light it up like a light bulb. Second, third, as this energy dances around, we're going to light up your spine. Fourth and fifth. Light it up brighter and brighter. Each vertebrae of the spine lights up bright like a light bulb. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Light it up brighter and brighter. Up, up, up your spine as these energies dance up your spine. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Light them up. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, light it up, you're almost to the heart, 21, light it up, blast your heart open, each vertebrae of the spine, one by one by one, 22, 23, 24, 25, light them up. 26, 27, 28, nearing the neck, 29, light them up. In the neck, 30, 31, 32, 33, light them up. Jacob's ladder all the way up. Go back to the bottom, light them up. Every vertebrae of your spine is lit up like a light bulb. Now go back to the bottom, back, back, back to the bottom. Activate this energy, breathing into that energy, creating it. You might feel a lot of energy in your root chakra. Now you're going to take your breath and you're going to pull it up, this energy, up the Eden, up the Bengala, up the Shishima, all this sacred Christos energy, all the way up Jacob's ladder. Breathe up. Put up your mulabanda, your root, lock, pull in your second lock, your third lock, all the way up to the top of your neck, where it ends in a cross. Pull it up, pull it up, pull it up, activating your, your cranial nerves, the 12 disciples, all the way up, pushing out the top of your head. Hold it. Release, keep your attention at the top of your head. And imagine your higher self, that liquid light pouring down, down, down. Imagine a chalice in your brain. Filling up with the light of your higher self at the bottom of your chalice is your pineal gland. This chalice fills up with liquid light. Filling it up. Filling it up, filling it up. This is the Holy Grail. And now find your pineal at the bottom of this Holy Grail. That small gland, go inside. Go inside, go inside this temple of light. Find it. Cleanse it out, activating rainbow light energy in it. Maybe blow the rainbow light energy out. And turn on your pineal gland like a light.
as your higher self, the human self, become one. When this happens, the pineal of the Father activates the pituitary gland in front. So go in front a little lower to the pituitary gland. Dancing around her. Taking your hand to your heart as you activate oxytocin and vasopressin. Going inside the pituitary gland. Blowing out oxytocin. Feeling your body fill up with tingling light of love. Just imagine. The pineal secreting a golden liquid. The pituitary secreting a white milky like substance into the land of milk and honey, dancing around your head. This is the seed of the star, the soul. The eternal living spark resides here. This is the living seed that connects with the main control unit of the body. The pineal is the charioteer. And in this is the oval egg in the center of the world. Activating your metaphysical light, conscious energy, light the soul. This is the battery of your body. And just dripping down, down, down your spine, down your spine, the vertebrae at the time, back behind your throat. Down, down, down your spine. Back to that root. Activate that root one more time. Purifying this light. Purifying this secretion. Moving that energy. Creating more of it. And pull it back up. Root lock, second lock, third lock, pull it up and push it out the top of your head. Hold it. Gently, effortlessly hold your breath. Hold it, push it out the top of your head. Activating the sun above you. And exhale, release back into that chalice. Filling up that chalice with your higher self. Pineal, pituitary gland, secrete that secretion. And this is your mystic ray temple. And that fractal of rainbow light goes in through your third eye, through the pituitary, through the pineal, out the well of dreams. And in this space, proclaim, I am liberated and free. And here we activate our Buddha consciousness and transcend the duality of this world. I am liberated and free. We call him Vishnu, who is a form of the Supreme Godhead. He creates universes and worlds inside your body. He is the preserver. In the Bhagavad Gita, Krishna explains that the ultimate goal of the mystic is to fix one's mind on the form of Vishnu within the heart. By doing so, you can transfer yourself to the spiritual world, which is beyond all material universes. Create an entire universe inside. 
and we call in Saint Germain with the violet flame to activate that pineal, work on it, pulsate it. And your third eye opens, 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 opens. The veils to dimensions thin. The doors to perception open, open, open. Find your way back into the pineal, into the sacred room, the sacred chamber of this antenna for the soul, the antenna for consciousness. Dance around it. Release. the DMT, release rainbow fractals of light, I have access to the higher realms and I trust my own magic, Guru Brahma, Guru Vishnu, Guru Devo, Maheshwara, Guru Sakshat, Param Brahma, Tatsmai Shri, Guru Ve, Namaha. You are your own Guru. Taking this beautiful light up through your head, through your crown chakra, that thousand petal lotus, and dance higher and higher and higher. Higher and higher. You are liberated.